Hi, this is Edit Joe, and welcome to another video in my series on Excel tips and tricks. Last time we looked at how to use the if statement um, to do a part of our uh, spreadsheet. We're going to now do another version of the if statement, and uh, I'll tell you why in a second. So, what I want to do is I want to check if someone is eligible to go and watch this movie. I want to see whether or not this rating is less than the age. So let's do a quick one. It's not going to work um, because we're going to run into problems for that one and that one over there. So let's just have a quick look. So I'm just going to do the equal if, open bracket. We're going to do the logical test. We're going to say if that one, that cell, is less than that cell, comma. So if that is true, show yes. Otherwise or else, show no. Close bracket. So if that cell is less than that cell, that is true, say yes, otherwise say no. So I'm going to enter. So they're not eligible, obviously, because this guy is too young. Now if I use the full handle and copy it, whoops, copy it down, you will see there's a problem here. Where's my PG? There. Mary is 35 years old, but she, she's not el eligible according to the formula that I've used. But that's only parental guidance, and she's already an adult. And the same with John Bainbridge. Uh, parental guidance there and he is 26 so obviously those two are wrong so how do we fix it obviously the if statement doesn't work so I will now introduce another type of if statement it's called the if or statement so it works slightly different so I'm gonna say equal if it starts the same open bracket now I'm gonna say or open bracket and now they want you to do logical tests. So I'm going to say, so if that one, that cell is less than that cell, comma, that means or if, I can't click there now, or if H4 is equal to PG, close bracket. So that's my logical. So if, th if that cell is less than that cell, or if the cell is equal to PG, all happens there. That's my logical test. Now I put in a comma. Now it's just like before. Comma. So if any one of those are true, we say yes. Else or otherwise, we say no. Close bracket. Enter. So now you can see if that is true, or that is true then show yes otherwise show no so now I'm going to enter that so obviously that's still valid because he's too young so he's not eligible I'm going to copy it down now you can see we have for Mary she can now go see that because it's PG and John can also go because the PG has changed so this is very useful to know that apart from the normal if statement you also get the if or statement where you can then sort of overcome this type of issue. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you very much.